Welcome. You got to bear with me. I'm pretty excited. The uh, I just got my uh, email for the process, so I was like, ah! I was in the middle of trying to record this and had to run and make a uh, uh, Prusa shipping email video instead. So now I'm back again, and what I wanted to talk about was happy surprises, which is kind of ironic that I then got my email from Prusa, but a while back, I bought some filament, um, Maker Geek filament called Transitional, which is really the a roll as they were transitioning from one color to another. So there's some inconsistencies. This one was la la labeled like gray or modern gray or something like that. In reality, it was purple on the outside. Well, I didn't realize or know how deep down inside the color would change. Um, so, yeah. I was printing with it, just kind of moving along, wasn't really paying attention. And then I got the, the uh, nozzle going, and you probably saw my previous video, and I started messing around with the 0.8 nozzle, printing at 0.6 layer heights. Um, started learning a little bit what you can't do that well. This thing's like a brick. Um, it's not made for stuff like this. Um, it's kind of messy and there was the edges started getting all kind of funky and stuff as you can see anyways so i decided to do a print of a vase and i did one of those twisted vases and i wanted to try as you can see in the background there that was an old version that i started and i only made it about halfway and, and it failed um so i wanted to do a full print and so I started it up, watched it start. Okay, life was good. And then later I came back when it was done and it only took three and a half, four hours for a full size vase, big CR10. And this is what I saw. It was gorgeous. I just could not believe, and it's big, but the look and the transition, it's going from, as you can see, the purple, the deep, deep, dark purple, and then all of a sudden it transits, transitions up into that gray. It's just, and it's, oh, it's unbelievable. You all get to see it if it actually breaks. If I cry a little bit, don't hold it against me. So did I mention my Mark III's coming? And I get a t-shirt. That beautiful. Unbelievable. Thing is awesome. It's sturdy. I mean, that's you can see the thickness of that. See if I can focus on it. Look how thick that is. It's hard to see. I know. Unbelievable. It looks cool down inside too. Just what you want to see inside a base. So anywho, I thought it would be neat to show it to you. I was pretty excited. I think it's going to look really awesome. And, uh, that's all I had. So thanks again. Enjoy and keep an eye out for the Prusa. Uh, good, as soon as I get that thing here, I'll do an unboxing of it. And then as soon as I can, I will do a build of it. And we'll probably do it live. Now, I don't know if I'll do it live or not. I, I haven't decided yet. We'll see. So anyways, thanks for watching and have a great day.